some scary moments after several people were hurt when a plane had to be evacuated just minutes after landing. Ryan Kath is live at the airport with the very latest. Hey, Ryan. Hi there, Elizabeth. And it was some nerve-wracking moments for more than 100 passengers on a Midwest flight coming to us from Milwaukee. Just the last few passengers are behind me at the baggage claim area uh, waiting, for theirs ba waiting for their bags. We did have a chance to talk to several passengers tonight about their experience. Here is what we know. The plane was approaching KCI just before 3.30 this afternoon. Passengers told us during that approach they noticed a sulfur-like smell. Didn't really know what to think about it at the time, but they said once they hit that runway after the plane decelerated, it made a pretty abrupt stop on the runway. And at that moment, the pilot came on the intercom and told everyone to evacuate immediately, leave their uh, carry-on items on the plane. And that's when the slides came out. Passengers in the back in the front of the plane slid down those slides safely to the runway. However, passengers in the middle of the plane near that emergency exit row actually had to go out onto the wing and then jump down to the runway from the wing. Now, that's how we assume four people were injured during this evacuation. However, three of those people did not want to go to the hospital. Just one of those people ended up going to the hospital for those injuries. So we're hearing a lot from passengers. We'll be sure to get you some of that sound we gathered from them coming up tonight at 6. We're told the FAA will be investigating the cause of that smell and smoke inside the plane, Elizabeth. But uh, definitely some interesting descriptions from these passengers about their experience here at KCI this afternoon. For now, we're live at KCI. Ryan Kath, NBC Action News.